Hey everyone, it's me. Today we're going to be looking for wild plantains and apples. Alright, so everybody knows that a common sign of apples being around is apple droppings. Now, right here is a perfect example. So, we're going to be looking for, we're going to be tracking this to its source. Now, oh, here's another one. Alright, here's another one. We're getting closer. Oh, oh look you can always tell that the source is right under it whenever the last apple was implanted into the ground. All right. Now we're gonna be showing you guys how to catch them. All right, everyone, so here's the tricky part. So, we all know that the, that the apple's right here because previously we found this apple underneath the implanted into the ground. So, if you don't have any um, shovels around, you can improvise with something like this. So, this is a tricky part, alright? You don't want to let them get away. Oh. I found, found a little bit of it. We don't want to disturb it. Dig around. It's starting to wake up. Gotta be a little bit more quiet. If I didn't have these magic gloves on, this would be a lot trickier. Find these any local anywhere. Doesn't matter where you get them. Starting to start moving around. Oh no. Oh, I got it. Sorry for that gruesome scene. This is fresh apple, straight from the source. It's not too shabby. All right, so the next wild fruit is banana. So the common place for bananas is in trees similar, similar to like this. All right, so we're gonna be climbing this tree to find bananas. See one. See it. Crap, it's just a plastic ball. Oh, there's a banana. Fresh from the wild bananas. Alright everybody, this is going to conclude our ways of surviving out in the wild. Uh, there's just a couple of ways of many, many more. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed. Uh, leave a comment and like if you really enjoyed this. Um, and...